This is the men's highlights of HSBC 7's LA. Rebage from the Toulon club. Inside to the Toulouse man, Dupont. Gets it away to Joseph. They do like to offload the ball, this French team. And it's going to create a try. Rayan Rebage runs it in for France. That's the go-ahead score right on half-time. But you've got to give it to the French defence that held Ireland out after multiple phases. Joseph just so strong on the wing, stands and delivers. And Rebage will get some reward for doing some hard work. Careful here, France. Don't want to come up with an error. Right on their own goal line. Work to do here with Joseph. Zayda, someone's ricocheted into the goalpost. And Joseph's over the 22. Dishes to Riva. Now Perez. Now it's a foot race. He's got support if he needs it. He's going to kick for Antoine Zayda. Oh, look at that. That is French flair all over. What a try. Oh, stop it. From behind their own goal line. Look at this, Jordan Conway. Oh, a McNulty gets smoked by the post. But look at that distribution on the inside. They had a lot of numbers. That's one of the best passes in the movement. Perez, I don't need a pass. I'm going to put it on the right foot. Look how it bounces up beautifully. Seconds almost out here. Ireland need a converted try to take it to sudden death. Here's Terry Kennedy. Mullen now. There's the siren for full time in regulation. McDonald, that blue wall holding firm for now. They're looking for a gap. And Mullen's found one, has he? Pops it up off the deck to Harry McNulty. Here he goes. What a tackle that is from Grandidier. Still alive for Ireland. Looking to reload. They've got numbers. It's Kennedy. He scores for Ireland. Two points the difference. And Billy Dunnis will be the man to take it to Golden Point if he can get this conversion between the uprights. Come off. Up. No charge. No charge. You cannot charge in sevens. You heard the referee. You can't yeah, charge in sevens. There'll be no Come Cheslin on. Colby antics here. 33% Ireland from this side of the field on conversions. Dardis! It just didn't come around. Ireland falls short. France hold on. And it will be France who will play for gold in Los Angeles. Ferguson again. There is Jamie Barden, the fresh legs, and look at him go. Bursting through the middle, he's got Ferguson with him, and he'll probably need him too. Ferguson times his support line I've got him absolutely here. perfectly. And it's Great Britain who score first. That's a lifting tackle Great Britain through the horizontal. The first shot through Ferguson on the support line. It's Jamie Barden. He's come on with fresh legs, as you say. He's roaming. And he needs someone on his shoulder, and it's the skipper, Robbie Ferguson. And in the end, it's a simple 2v1. There's Barden. Good line speed here from Spain. Shooting out is Paul Plar and Nieto. Pegging Great Britain back, but Ethan Waddleton has muscled his way through. The pincer movement is coming onto it. Hey, Lopez puts him on the floor. Stay Barreto. Up. Wants quick ball, wasn't as quick as he would have liked, but still might work out here. Alex Davis with a line beckoning, and he will get there. That's two tries for Great Britain. That's 10-0 now. Really solid work and a solid finish from AJ Davis in the corner. But how about the work from Ethan Waddleton up the middle? Shows it goes against the line speed. Steps through, two tacklers out of the grasp of another. And then AJ makes no mistake on the edge. Great Britain will go for gold in Los Angeles. And the ball out to Dardis, and now McNulty on the wing. It's Matthew McDonald. McDonald finds a little bit of help in Zach Ward. Zach Ward going to swerve his way into the first try for Ireland. 
Well, they make it look easy, don't they? Zach Ward just gliding along at high speed. Nice ball, little dip, great pickup. Really nice. The kick out from McDonald and the left inside to Zach Ward. Through the hands. Kennedy, a wrap around. Oh, it's a great pass to Che Mullins. Mullins, Jaime Manteca is chasing, not going to get Mullins. And Ireland extends their lead. A good run in for Che Mullins, chased all the way by Jaime Manteca. But it's the TK show once again. Steps in between two defenders and lifts it. And then it's Che Mullins. He looks across. He sees the track in front of him, puts his head down, one foot in front of the other. But now is GB there looking for their first. It looks like Tom Emery might have popped a hamstring or a calf, and the, the ball's loose. And Buddy and Pasquet's onto it. Big defence coming in from Great Britain as Pasquet tried to charge through. Rabadge is there. Look at the numbers in this breakdown for Great Britain. If France can spin this out, they could be in business. Zadar uses the step. Zadar the spin and the score. Antoine Zadar, the Monegasque, with the opening try in the Los Angeles Cup final. Oh no, that's the worst thing ever for Tom Emery. He's got a feel for him. Try to get it out to his skipper. And then France and Zadar, the strength to hit and spin. He's an absolute sniper. France leading by seven. Men's Cup final in Los Angeles. There's the offload to Joseph. And another one back to Zadar, and another one to Rebush. Brilliant hands. Oh, and again. And Perez dives in for France's second. But look at this great continuity. The offloading, I was waiting for it. They were punching and counter punching both teams. But in the end, France throw their flair amongst it. And Stefan Perez, the point guard this weekend, who sends it long. Fournier juggles it, swings it out to Aaron Grandinier, a former England Sevens Academy player against Great Britain here in the final. Fournier, change of direction to Dupont, thinks about the cross kick and then rips it wide to Andy Timo, the 19-year-old with the big right foot step. He's still going, shoved forward by his captain. Pasquet, Dupont, Dupont, double clutch, Fournier. And that could well be that in the cup final for France. And it's another try assist to Anton Dupont. Takes to go long, sees the hole, and then puts it on a platter for Theo Fournier. And it's going to be Alain La Bleu tonight here in Los Angeles. France are Los Angeles champions. Antoine Dupont mobbed by his teammates. This new star. So here are the men's standings now as they stand. And well, look at Great Britain. They're now in ninth spot and they're just one point behind the USA who are in eighth. Remember the bottom four after seven events in Singapore will play off to maintain core nation status. France are up to fourth with their 20-point haul here. And at the very top, Argentina still top of the pots with 90 points all up, and Ireland just keep on keeping on. They've had another good tournament. France, champions in Los Angeles. Delight for Dupont. Formidable for France. And the celebrations can begin.